Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Supreme Lord 2020 as Japan. Last time we were kind of struggling against uh, Manchuria and before we start I did notice a few things that I didn't realize. Uh, remember when I mentioned N for some reason that says 666 what, uh, whatever but anyway as, as I was saying uh, remember when I said about um, how there's not much wars going on currently? Well, it turns out that in my haste, when I was setting this game up, I forgot to double check my world volatility and it's on medium. So, that pretty much means that only a certain, only certain nations would go to war for any reason. So any familiar wars that might happen, uh, with some exceptions, wouldn't really happen anymore. Israel, it might be possible for them to just declare war out of nowhere. Same with uh, Serbia, I think. Possible in the future. And of course, there are of course, a lot of uh, other headaches as well. Also, I uh, have to thank one user to kind of give me a uh, list, if you will, of certain nations that I might may need to try and, and make trade or maybe even an alliance if I want to. That, of course, is not yet for now. I might do it a little later when I have the time, hopefully. And unfortunately, I am going to have to make a few changes in the pl plan to conquer Manchuria, especially when there's a possibility that Eastern Siberia and Inner Mongolia might declare war eventually. As as much as I would like to conquer the capital, all these artillery are becoming a, is becoming a problem. And it certainly doesn't help when they still have plenty of ammunition, let alone fuel, to be honest. So we'll just continue, but I will make some changes. We'll just do what we have here, just conquer, hopefully, uh, the city, at the very least. But afterwards, I'm going to pull them back, conquer Yi Cole, entrench them wherever I can, and then perhaps deal with the annoyance of Dalian, just conquer that. Actually, I might do that now with these units. By trenching them here, hold on to that. So that's fine. And all these units need to move up immediately. Is there anybody here? Yep, there are a few garrisons, so... It's nice to know. Yeah, attack immediately. How's the city? That's not gonna fall just yet. Okay, here comes the Manchuria Navy. And a lot of these... Eh, ever useless infantry type units. And we've ca finally captured that, but I'm gonna turn them around. I don't wanna waste, sacrifice so many of my units now. That, and build some new roads over here. Diplomatic offer from North Carolina, I'll accept. Here we go. Jilin is now gonna fall. Next up, Yongji. Yongji, I think that's how you say it. And the Manchurians might capture that, recapture that again. That's fine. And then back. Have you all move down here and entrench. Not these units that are damaged. I have a somewhat size a sizable navy. However, I need to build more land fabrications immediately so we can try and get our military up as fast as we can. Same with our navy. And back on the home islands. Well, it's somewhat of a slow process, progress, of building up the army. There's three land fabrications there, all that. Up here there is none, so I'm not just about to build three over there and leave that alone. UN provides military advisors, that's kind of nice to know, I guess. Also need to check the diplomacy 
yep, Eastern Siberia has joined the war. So sadly, I really couldn't do anything to prevent that. But I may need to check to see what resources we might need from this area. Agriculture, water, not much. Timber, a few. Petrol. Okay, there's a good pet. There's a lot of good area over here that we could use. So I'm gonna change these direction of these units to go westward a little bit. This area on the other hand is becoming a nightmare. I do have some spies that I'm gonna try and recon this area just to see what we're gonna be dealing with and have these guys turn around immediately. The rest of them, uh, I think I'll have these head, oops, head over here. Okay, Yi Tong is captured. Can we take this village? Alright. Uh, Liao Yuan next, I think. Next there will be some supply depots and a barracks. Much closer to the front lines. Leave that alone. Have you all get over here and attack. I'm gonna leave this area alone. It's gonna be taken back by the Manchurians, that's fine. Now you are gonna fall, you retreat. Okay, surprisingly generous by North Carolina. Next up are these towns and probably these mines if I want to. Okay, did that village just... Yeah, it probably did. Pretty sure it just automatically repaired itself rather quickly, unusually. Unusually quickly, I might add. I have to say, actually. Now you have the <clears throat> right. So that area is captured. Time to move up here. The submarines, I don't know, since so these are outdated after all. But at any rate, uh, gotta get the army up here so they can load up onto these transports. And uh, thank you, Zimbabwe. Yep, bad idea, bad idea, bad idea. Over here, build another naval fabrication, I guess. But also if I want to build land fabrications and fill that out. That's it. Leave that alone. Have you all go over here next. To Dawa. Trench there. No, 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 no. Don't go to the capital just yet. Now a lot of artillery here. This engineer needs to get repaired though. Some of these units. Reduce the industrial capacity capabilities of Manchuria a bit. Okay, I really meant to just entrench there. And have all of you load up immediately. Hold on to that. On to... No, not escort. This transport. This one. You know, probably a few. So that LST. Try that again. And finally that one. And they're all loaded up. So they're just going to entrench and have all of these unit ships. Get over here. Grab these guys. Get over here. Head in this direction to take those coal mines. And we're getting a lot of messages. Okay, I don't want this topic while people bought it. Move those, and those are slightly outdated. And now head up here. Easily taking that, even though some of the units are taking a lot of damage. Get her there. Take out the next mine. 
we've just lost that area, that's fine. Okay, some of these units go around since I need them all to surround this area. Research breakthrough. It's nice to know. Okay, next up is Panjin, which they just entrenched. Will them stay there? Okay, we've slowly gained these lands, but we're losing areas at a lot more quickly than I would have liked. Now those ships here, yes, they are getting close. Now a few submarines, I'll just send them up here, especially against Chi North China. Okay, what else do I have? Patrols, destroyers, all these ships are just patrolling you know, for whatever reason. So, I'm not sending them over here, so that would be a death trap for them. Okay, we're doing a lot of damage this way. Get over here, grab up these lands, if we can. If, that is, if we can. And head north. It, it is a slight waste of time to just conquer these places one after the other, but... Let's just say I'm done... Let's just say I'm not really that confident trying to take the capital Shen Yang. I mean, with my Vietnam LP, it was like somewhat easy-ish, quote-unquote. But for Japan at this point, at that, I have doubts. I have slight doubts about that. Anyway, these are taken over. I'm going to connect them to a new railway line. Finally taking that. Connect it there, connect it there, and then finally connect the bridge there. Using these dams, at least. And then this one cross into China's Manchuria lands themselves. And connect over here. So I'll leave that alone. Okay, we've weakened, the, we've weakened the Manchuria a lot now. Get over here in a trench. You guys deal with these units and just kill them off, I guess. Oh, new barracks is done here. Cool in the uh, industrial complex. Bridge over here is long finished, but I swear I need to get him over here. All of you unload. Likely not all of them, but close enough. Okay, what do you want, East Germany? I guess I'll accept. Hey, that was all of them. Now, to see if I can make trade agreements with other nations. West Germany. Okay, do you need anything? Yes, you do. Wales. Uh, relations are... not that great. But that'll do. Oh, dear. This is slightly becoming a mess. Sadly, the barrack series isn't going to be done yet. Not yet, but close. Okay, have all of you take that. All of you just do whatever you want or rather be entrenched somewhere. We're slowly gaining territory here through supplies, I guess. Not much, though. Okay. Who else are they at war with? Western Siberia, Tibet, well, Thailand, Japan, Mongolia, and Eastern Siberia. Hmm. Alright. Okay, move up. How's... okay. I really need this to be 60%. I need taxes reduced a bit to 50% for everything. With the exception of unemployment. Reduce that. Same with pension taxes. I'll reduce that. Property taxes at 
3.5 maybe? Uh, sales tax right there. Corporate taxes are 35. Small businesses 30s and with low income. And that should be it. Okay, well, I'll destruct it. Anything happen? Uh, of course, that didn't quite end well. That's okay. Now, where are those gas fields? Right up here. Where Mon Inner Mongolia has this area. There's a good patch over here, so that's fine. The rest of the oil is up here, which could mean Eastern Siberia will get the majority, I'm guessing. Coal, we have plenty right now. Probably don't need those at the moment. Metal ore, all of it's under our control. Uranium, the remaining few are just here, so I'll start mining them anyway. Everything else I'll leave alone. Sadly though, the economy is not doing quite well. T-80 retreat. All these units are damaged and are repairing. Can you try and take Yushu? I want all of you to get out of there. Barracks is not done yet. How's our military approval gone up? Yep. Whoa! Uh, expensive, but I need, but I would like to have those units. However, I want them to get repaired immediately. I still got these units to load up. Load onto that transport. This one. Uh, and that. You two get out of the way. Tax, uh, economy treasury has gone back up a little bit. Briefly. So get over here. All of you repair immediately as well. Um, what else? Capital is slightly surrounded, but it's not going to be enough. All of my units are just heavily damaged rather quickly, I might add. I might have to say. So I'll get the Navy out. See if they can find that uh, submarine fleet that's somewhere. Ah, the supply depot at Pyongyang is finished. It's nice to know. But over here, got too many building projects. That probably is going to hurt the economy a little bit. Can we take that? Doubts. Over in trench, all of you in trench here just in case. Their military approval is not gonna change anything and this T-72 needs to retreat. Right. Connect that, connect here. I think that's about it for now. Except for those. Oh no 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 no, I don't want to select all of them. Little ships here? Two of them. Get them over here. Have these transports unloaded. And all up to the front line. That should be it. And the artillery at Xinming is proven to be problematic. Over here now. The majority of my navy needs to get on the other side. Well, actually, pass through here through the 
rather massive North Chinese Navy, which includes a carrier. The barracks is over here is finished. At least I'm sure there's a summer. Okay, that was a Manchurian patrol ship. And another one. Just gotta sink their fleet a little bit, bit by bit. There was another one. There they are! Can we sink it? Can we sink them? I mean, it would be nice to have them under our control, but... Let's get rid of them. Now all that's left is the S41 Han. Wow. All that just to sink those submarines. And all I have are just two ships. Two submarines left. That sucked. There's a previous light tank there. You can't repair. What do you want? I'll accept. I have no choice. Mostly my armies are way too damaged. Especially my Air Force. Okay, you know, that was a waste of time. Forget those oil fields, forget the resources up there. I'll probably get them, get some of them, but I'll let Inner Mongolia and Eastern Mongolia have them once. Make sure I possibly might fall. I don't know. I have doubts about that, but... I seem to have too much doubts right now. <laughs> Considering that Manchuria is proving to be a little bit more difficult to uh, defeat. Okay, more land fabrications are finished. So those are done. I got several uranium deposits. Wait, speaking of uranium... Ah, uh, yes, I have mines over here that are all finished. But... Nah, I'll just leave it alone. Ore mines, not a whole lot. Now, will these units get over here to trench? Actually, every unit that's on Japan itself needs to get over here. How's the economy? Taxes, keep it at 50 for now. Social spending, increase to 60%, and leave it low. And most of our forces here are kind of wiped out. Wiped out. Right. It's nice to know. Can we take this dam here? Hydro facilities? We kind of can. Here comes an A unit that's just stopped. Okay, all these units to gather this coal mine. There's still one small town we didn't take, or we did take, but it was under control of partisans. I don't know. Uh, land fabrication, that's nice to know. How's our production? New tanks, new artillery are being produced rather slowly. Uh, really? Ugh. How can the North Koreans, at least here, at least in this depiction, not have any form of land fabrications in the first place? Near their capital, I mean. I'll just leave that alone. At any rate, okay. Yeah, there's no way we're gonna take the capital with this force. There's no way, we need a much larger army. Another land fortification is done. Load onto these transports again. Yeah. Are you not loading up? Okay, why not? Uh, Alright. Load onto that one. You two, I should have sent back earlier. Thank you for finally loading up. Now where? Of course. 
scrap. Don't need it. Our economy is shrinking rather quickly. And briefly recovered. All of our submarine fleet is just here. We have a patrol unit, so I'll just send them out, I guess. We've lost that area, that's understandable. And now to check. Any wars going on? Israel's not at war with anybody yet. At least I think yet. I don't know. Pers uh, Marcel, can we make an alliance or trade agreement? We already have a trade so leave them alone. Rome, no. We have lots of trade agreements with several nations. So I'll leave them alone. Okay, we still have a... Okay, California is not at war with anybody. Alaska. Uh... Where's that? Who else? Florida? Nah. Virginia. I'll probably go back to checking the list one more time. To see other nations and write them down. The nations I may need to try making alliances or trade agreements. Alright. Barracks here. It's finished. Supply Depot is not yet. No surprise about that. Let's see... Fighters, not really much there. Strangely, I'm wishing Eastern Siberia would actually advance somewhere. Can they? I don't know why. They wouldn't, but... Oh well. Okay, we're taking way too much casualties. How much supply do was... 60... Okay, where is... Okay, military goods in Shenyang. Consumer goods in Fuxin. Okay? Okay, so we finally took Liao Yang. Massive casualties. That's been taken over. Now, if we can try and take Fushin, which I have slight doubts. All the artillery here. I'm gonna send them up immediately to help. So these units are outdated no matter what. Okay, retreat, retreat. There's no way we're gonna break through that. I mean, the sheer amount of artillery is ridiculous. No matter how many we kill, they just keep sending more out. And their air force, somewhat non-existent, but still annoying. Let me kill that. Thank you. Okay. down here to these units that are constantly bombarded, move to that. Their military approval has gone down, but it's not going to cause a coup of some sort to result in the government, the current government, to just surrender. Doesn't help, I guess, with Inner Mongolia not doing much, same with East Siberia and all. There's nothing I can do force them, or a plan of some sort, to attack from different sides, and we can ensure no matter what, but that's not gonna happen. And that unit's gonna retreat, and he's gonna be a nuisance again. This area's cut off. At least the garrisons are... some of At least the garrisons are holding strong. Sort of. Oi. I gotta say, Japan has proven to be a bit more difficult to tr 
try and conquer as at the very least. We got more reinforcements, but it probably wouldn't do much. We're so close to the capital, but it probably won't help because of the amount of artillery they have. I've said it so many times, but I really have to keep pressing it over and over again. The artillery is becoming a mod a nightmare. Especially in Manchuria right now. No matter how hard we try, we're constantly losing forces faster than we could replace. Oh, we had the momentum, but... And, yeah. Too many units are retreating, too many units are constantly getting killed off. And I need them to turn around and deal with these units and kill them off. Hopefully. This engineer... And then this artillery piece. ICBM, whatever. Or, Scud Launcher, I mean. That unit's gonna die, or not. But, I'll have these guys move up this way and attack Xin Lin. Have them move, have these units move this way. Take that again. Move up here. Reclaim those and attack from the other side. Except for that, we'll leave it alone. You get over here and entrench, you... I don't know where you're going. Okay, that area is lost. All of you get over here now. I don't want you to stay over here. It's a death... Yeah, that area is a problem anyway. All of you get over here. I don't know why you're constantly... ...reserving there. Get over here to the uh, barracks and repair, quote unquote, for that. Hey, okay, all I have is one tank, and that's it. So you move out of the way. All of these transports get over here, and we fail to take the city of uh, the town of Zigmin. Well, that's just lovely. At least we gained a lot of land here, but that's not going to be helpful. If only we could just try to take that, then get our forces here, then attack from all sides onto their capital. That's going to take a while, though. Especially the army building up rather... <laughs> uh, rather slowly. We have a large force, though. Uh, what military facility? Land fabrication. Land fabrication. Okay, so they're done in Dalian. Well, the ones in Dalian are done, I mean. I'm always getting my words mixed up. You retreat immediately. However, I'm gonna deploy garrisons as best as best I can. All of you hit up here immediately. Uh, I didn't mean to pause. Now try to take this. And deploy more garrisons. Put here. Uh, send whatever's left of the Air Force and help. You... I'm not gonna bother. All of you, however... Actually, you know what? Even if you're damaged, just get over here. Finally, that's been taken over. And entrench. Just entrench. Yeah, I meant to, uh, yeah, forget it. <laughs> that was a little stupid. But I'm going to end right here. So, sorry if you've been, some of you may be hoping Manchuria would fall, but that's not going to happen yet. 
Their capital is slightly surrounded, but they are still surrounded by their massive number of artillery. Hopefully, though, next time we will uh, try and gather all the armies around here and then hopefully take Shenyang and grab whatever land we can get. I'm sure Ada Mongolia will get a good portion up here, probably up around here, I guess. I don't know. Save base to Siberia, around here. But, you win some, you lose some, I guess. If that's the right choice of word, uh, quote. But, I hope you enjoyed this, and see you again in the next episode.